Hello, welcome to Adobe Dynamic Page. Today, let us look at Central Bank Digital Currencies, CBDCs. Central Bank Digital Currencies, CBDCs, are digital currencies issued and regulated by central banks, representing a digital form of fiat currency. Unlike decentralized cryptocurrencies such as Bitcoin or Ethereum, CBDCs are centralized and typically have the backing and full faith of the issuing government. CBDCs aim to combine the benefits of digital currencies with the stability and regulatory oversight of traditional fiat currencies. Here's an overview of CBDCs and their implications. Types of CBDCs Retail CBDCs, these are digital currencies issued by central banks for use by the general public. Retail CBDCs aim to replace physical cash and offer a digital alternative for everyday transactions. Wholesale CBDCs Wholesale CBDCs are used for interbank transactions and settlement between financial institutions. They are typically not accessible to the general public and are used to facilitate large value and high volume transactions in the financial system. Motivations for CBDCs Financial inclusion CBDCs can improve financial inclusion by providing access to digital financial services for individuals who are unbanked or underbanked. Payment efficiency, CBDCs can enhance the efficiency of payment systems by enabling faster, cheaper, and more secure transactions, reducing reliance on cash and legacy payment infrastructure. Monetary policy tools, CBDCs offer central banks new tools for implementing monetary policy, such as direct transfers to households, negative interest rates, or programmable money. Regulatory oversight, CBDCs allow central banks to maintain regulatory oversight and control over the monetary system, mitigating risks such as money laundering, terrorism financing, and tax evasion. Design considerations Privacy and security, CBDCs must balance the need for privacy and security with regulatory requirements, ensuring that transactions are both confidential and traceable to prevent illicit activities. Interoperability, interoperability with existing payment systems and international standards is essential to ensure seamless integration of CBDCs into the global financial system. User experience, CBDCs should be user-friendly and accessible to individuals of all ages and technical backgrounds, supporting a wide range of devices and interfaces for digital payments. Scalability and resilience, CBDCs must be capable of handling large transaction volumes and maintaining uptime, even during times of high demand or network congestion. Challenges and risks Technological infrastructure Implementing CBDCs requires robust technological infrastructure, including secure networks, digital identity systems, and user-friendly interfaces. Regulatory frameworks Developing appropriate regulatory frameworks for CBDCs involves addressing complex legal, monetary, and financial stability considerations. Cybersecurity threats CBDCs are susceptible to cybersecurity threats such as hacking, fraud, and data breaches, requiring robust security measures to safeguard against potential risks. Economic implications CBDCs may have far reaching economic implications, including changes to monetary policy, financial stability, and the role of central banks in the digital age. Overall, CBDCs represent a significant development in the evolution of money and payments, with the potential to reshape the global financial system. However, their successful implementation requires careful consideration of design choices, regulatory frameworks, and technological infrastructure to ensure that CBDCs deliver on their promises while mitigating potential risks and challenges.